It's the free public testing sites, the drive through operations generating thousands of tests. Both the city and county have two each. There are others, United Memorial Medical Center among them, and walk-up sites like Legacy Community Health. Most sent the samples to a pair of large national testing labs. The samples set out of state for testing, which creates a bottleneck. But now Legacy seeing an improvement. We have been informed that the third-party lab that we use was able to send our samples to different processing sites. Uh, they've added more since we started. And so the more recent swabs that we've done have allowed us to get a, a faster turnaround time, closer to three to five days versus the 10 to 14 days that we were experiencing with our first batch. Houston and Harris County use their own labs as well as the two national testing companies, both still seeing patients being informed of their results in about two weeks. United Memorial Medical uses a local lab, which is working 24-7. Its results can be back in 4 to 24 hours, but getting the results to the patients is also time-consuming. Once we have called all the patients that are positive, then we start calling the patients that are negative. But we are now in the thousands. I mean, we're, we've done over 2,700 or so uh, tests. About to enter the market, an FDA-approved blood-based test based on detecting antibodies to the virus, which means there's been an exposure and it takes minutes for a result. For now, a lot of people, though, in limbo and self-quarantine. Certainly, if we knew earlier, within three to four days, we could let them know if they were negative, they could resume their normal activities. Private doctors may be able to use a private lab to do testing with a shorter turnaround. Absent of that, the best advice for the moment is to be calm and patient. Another proposed testing method seeking FDA emergency approval involves a phone app and a test you give yourself. That story at 6. In Montrose, Deborah Bigley, ABC 13 Eyewitness News. All right, Deborah, thank you. I think patience is going to be the name of the game for everybody right now. Now, if you live in Harris County and you want to find a testing site, you can go to the county's website at readyharris.org. Once you get there, you take a self-assessment test to see if you meet that criteria for testing, Eric. All right, a lot of thanks. And here in Houston.